I was asked on Reddit whether I was able to translate Mr. Inoue Naoshisa's interview that was at the end of this booklet. I didn't include it in my video on my translation on how I harvested a star, which you can find a link in the video descriptions. So I made this as a supplementary video. I tried my best on the translations here, but if there's any inaccuracies, please let me know in the comments. Thank you. Mr. Miyazaki created this movie coming from both the mangas I wrote, the story of Iblard, and a story I heard in a maze town, from my art book, Iblard, and my picture book, A Trip to Iblard. The origin of creating this film was through my conversation a while back with Mr. Mia on my picture book, The Day I Harvested a Star. Mr. Mia got very lively in our conversation on the details of the story, and he ultimately made a storyboard for it. I'm still, however, not finished with my own picture book, Mr. Inoue laughs. Iblard is a world in which I created. Iblard is not a world in the sky, but rather it's a world I think that's based on the reality of our world. The name Iblard originates from Kenji Miyazawa. He made Iwatorb, the location in his fairy tale like work, based on where he lived at the time, Iwate Prefecture. By giving it this name, you can now see it as a totally different world. And so this is the reason I named my world Iblard. It is based on the place I live, Osaka Prefecture, Ibaraki City. Even if they are the same place and you are accustomed to its scenery, strangely by changing the name, the locale starts to feel livelier. And thus I didn't create this world haphazardly, but this is how I always view this place, and the drawings reflect this. I came to an agreement to work on this project since the time of Mr. Mia's work, with Spur of the Heart. This time, I had them draw something that looked like a house that was in Nina's store. Because of the skills of Ghibli's photography department, they were able to create a beautiful scene which I loved. Even so, this movie is like a gateway to a grand story. Just the scene of Nona nurturing his star is enjoyable, but what's also something to note are the frog and the mole characters. They are specifically picking the right candidate to sell a star. Nona was able to select something. Perhaps that is the reason why his bicycle broke down. I did introduce those characters in my manga, but if you observe, those two are actually magic wielders. Although I don't know if they have much skill in magic, Mr. Inoue laughs. You can actually see somewhat of fear and respect they have for Nina. Moreover, the town that Nona escaped from, as well as the world in which Nina resides in, is something that we have fun thinking about. Mr. Mia dares not to say too much about his work here, and he said that he simply created the work as if it were a poem. As I recall, if you watch the movie, there are some parts of my work that hasn't been added to the film, which is a bit of a mystery. In this movie, I think Mr. Mia wanted to borrow from the adolescent mind of a boy named Nona and express how the world looks different when he begins to see it with his own consciousness or awareness and not with the viewpoints given to him by others. But when the star grows up to a certain degree, he realizes that he must surrender to the natural passage of time. In his limited time in Iblard, he realizes and starts to understand this and allows his precious star to leave and go on a trip on its own. But the one that really went on the trip on his own was surely Nona himself. What saved Nona was Nina's words. That's lovely which was also a kind of magic. Sometimes people's words and actions become magic, a power we all have, but many people don't realize it. I think that is one way of looking at this world. That is, although this place may look a little bit illusory, there's still much reality in it that we cannot forget. Further, in all of his works, they all have a sense that the world is such a wondrous, wonderful, and exciting place. Even through this work, it seems like we are all caught under Mr. Mia's magic.